A company in South Wales is playing an integral part in delivering Boxer, the British Army's next-generation armoured fighting vehicle. MILDEF, who are based in Cardiff, will provide rugged electronics such as crew station PCs, servers and Ethernet switches, for the Boxer armoured fighting vehicles under a £20 million subcontract awarded to them by RBSL and Rheinmetall. The contract is expected to sustain and secure further development of MILDEF's manufacturing facilities in the city over the next 10 years. Secretary of State for Wales Simon Hart said, Thousands of jobs in Wales are supported by UK defence expenditure, and this latest £20 million investment shows our continued commitment to invest in Welsh suppliers, cementing Wales's place as a defence industry hub. I welcome this investment which comes at a time when the UK's armed forces are providing crucial support to the NHS. Major General Darren Crook, Director Land Equipment for Defence Equipment and Support, said, The British Boxer program has continued at pace this year despite the significant challenges that 2020 has set us. I am delighted that we are now beginning to see real-term benefits to the UK from the investment in the programme, and proud that we will be delivering a state-of-the-art future capability to our British armed forces. Duncan Skinner, Chief Sales Officer at MILDEF Group, said, We are delighted to supply high-performance products together with RBSL into one of the UK MOD's strategic vehicle programmes. MILDEF Limited continues its expansion in the UK defence industry, and this contract is an example of the exciting times ahead for the company. The UK decided to rejoin the Boxer programme in 2018, and since then has committed £2.8 billion to deliver over 500 vehicles to the British Army. They will be made up of four variants, an infantry carrier, a specialist carrier, a command vehicle, and an ambulance. Much of the fleet is planned to be built in Telford, and Stockport by main contractors RBSL and WFEL, supported by a nationwide supply chain that will secure around 1,000 jobs nationwide, and create an ambitious UK apprenticeship scheme. The aim is to have the first vehicles in service in 2023. The Defence Secretary has announced that a £2.8 billion deal has been signed to provide the British Army with around 500 new armoured vehicles. Funding has been approved for the Mechanised Infantry Vehicle MIV, program to deliver around 500 Boxer armoured vehicles, and form part of the Army's strike brigades. The Boxer can be deployed around the world to deliver soldiers around the battlefield, travelling long distances quickly, cross-country, under enemy fire and in the most austere of environments. It is modular by design, meaning that the same vehicle base platform can be quickly reconfigured with different modules to fill different roles. Initially the Army will buy a troop-carrying variant, an ambulance, a command vehicle and a specialist carrier. The Mechanised Infantry Vehicle MIV, is the British Army's concept of an 8x8 wheeled vehicle. On 31 March 2018 the United Kingdom rejoined the Boxer Armoured Fighting Vehicle program in order to move to an assessment phase, which may see the Boxer selected. On 19 July 2018 via Voluntary Transparency Notice the UK MOD disclosed its intent to order between 400 and 600 boxers in four variants plus driver training vehicles, reference vehicles and support. The contract will contain options to increase the quantity of vehicles by up to an additional 900. On 19 September 2018, UK Defence Minister Stuart Andrew announced that Artec had been given the go-ahead to invite industry to bring forward actual contractable proposals for work on Boxer, allowing Artec to complete their supplier selection process before returning to the MOD with a formal proposal in 2019. Figures remain as, over 500, and with the first vehicles to be in service by 2023. The concept of MIV arose through the failed Future Rapid Effect System FRES, program, which was to deliver vehicles that would replace the British Army's Reconnaissance and Combat Vehicle Reconnaissance Tract CVRT, fleet. The FRES Utility Vehicle UV, was that specific program to create armoured personnel carriers to replace vehicles such as the FV-432 and CVRT variants such as the Spartan. The winning design provisionally selected for the FRES utility vehicle contract was the Piranha V, manufactured by General Dynamics. However, no production order was announced, and the programs was later restructured and then failed to restart. FRES was cancelled and split into two vehicle programs, Scout which would later be the Ajax Scout SV and the utility vehicle. 
after the Strategic Defense and Security Review 2010, then Lieutenant General Nick Carter formed the Army 2020 concept to shape the British Army. That plan envisioned three armored infantry brigades, each with a heavy protected mobility battalion. This unit would have Mastiff vehicles and later, Utility Vehicle S or UV, the concept from FRES UV. Mechanized Infantry Vehicle MIV. The UV program later transformed into the MIV program. In September 2015, Chief of the General Staff General Sir Nick Carter mentioned to reporters that the British Army wished to revive the UV through a MIV program. Seventh, This was further confirmed in the 2015 Strategic Defense and Security Review fact sheets. The MIV vehicles, along with the Ajax Scout SV vehicles, will form two new strike brigades. Design and characteristics Several news articles had speculated that it might be based on the design of the French VBCI infantry fighting vehicle. In February 2014, France agreed to lend a few VBCIs to the British Army for testing. French military sources also reported that the British Army is interested in purchasing the vehicle. General Dynamics Land Systems also offered a model while Saint Kinetics offered its Terex as a variant. The Boxer and Patria AMVX were favorites, as well. On 31 March 2018 the British Army rejoined the Boxer program. The Boxer is an eight-wheeled multirole vehicle, consisting of two key elements, the platform, drive line and the removable mission module. The mission module is a key feature of Boxer, it allowing the vehicle to be rapidly changed to meet different operational requirements. Mission modules are attached by four points and can be swapped within an hour under field conditions. The Boxer is a multirole armored fighting vehicle designed by an international consortium to accomplish a number of operations through the use of installable mission modules. The nations participating in the Boxer program have changed as the program has developed. The Boxer vehicle is produced by the ARTEC GmbH, Armored Vehicle Technology, Industrial Group, and the program is being managed by OCCAR, Organization for Joint Armament Cooperation. ARTEC GmbH is based in Munich, its parent companies are Krauss Maffei Wegmann GmbH and Rheinmetall Military Vehicles GmbH on the German side, and Rheinmetall Defense Nederland BV for the Netherlands. Overall, Rheinmetall has a 64% stake in the joint venture. A distinctive and unique feature of the vehicle is its composition of a drive platform module and interchangeable mission modules which allow several configurations to meet different operational requirements. Other names in use or previously used for Boxer are GTK, Gepanzertes Transport Kraftfahrzeug, Armored Transport Vehicle, Boxer and MRAV, Multirole Armored Vehicle, confirmed Boxer customers as of February 2020 are Germany, the Netherlands, Lithuania, Australia and the UK. The Boxer has been produced in AO, A1 and A2 configurations, clarification needed. The UK will receive the A3 Boxer, contradictory, and Australia is receiving an A2-A3 hybrid.